In this video today, I'm going to show you how to use Splice. So I downloaded it today and it's pretty cool so far. Uh, what it is, is you pay a monthly subscription of eight bucks and you get access to literally thousands of different samples, whether it's one shots, vocal chops, anything you think of, you can search on Splice and get it. Um, so once you make an account, you'll get this little standalone program. And what it is, is you can do everything on this little standalone. You can search for samples by filter. So if you want one shots, you can filter by one shot. If you want vocals, you can literally just search vocals and get loops. And so what I'm gonna do today is I'll take a loop, throw it into Ableton, and then put a drum on top of it. Make a super simple beat like that, just so you guys are familiar with the process. So starting off, it's really easy. Once you find a sample that you like, you add it to your library. And once it's in your library, you can take it and drag it into whatever you need. So like, this is a triangle sound. All I did was drag it into my drum pad. And this is the loop that I used in Ableton today. It's pretty simple. Uh, I'll play it for you guys. So once you get that, all you do is you can take it and then drag it and drop it into your DAW. It's super simple, really easy. So once you've got that, you can do whatever you want. Um, I haven't bothered doing any chopping or anything like that. The only thing I have done is in the second iteration of the loop down here, I put an EQ on it, throw it through a filter, cut out some of the low end and lower the volume overall to make more space in the mix if I want to add a counter melody. So here's what it sounds like in the DAW so far. <laughs> Okay, so from here, what I'll do is I'll just throw some drums on top of it. So for my drums, I just have the standard drum rack in Ableton. I've picked out a couple sounds. I've got a kick, a snare, and a triangle. And so the triangle was pulled from Splice as well. So here it is in Splice. All I did was drag and drop it into whatever key I want it to be placed at. So I've armed my drums. I'm just going to throw a simple pattern down. And for that, I'm using my Launchpad Mini. I've mapped it so I can just play the pads. So here we go. I like that. Alright, so that's the drums. I'll duplicate that so it carries through the sample. Now I'll put down 808. And for my 808, all I did was uh, pull the sample off Reddit, tuned it, and this is what it sounds like. And here we go. I just want to play it real quick, figure out what sounds good. Alright, so I'll lay this. So for this, I'm going to cut it up or uh, cut it down and then I'm going to quantize just to make everything sound clean, hit where it's supposed to. And there you go. 
So now that the drums and the 808 are laid, I'll throw in some hi-hats. Now I'm going to duplicate it through the... lower the 808 a little bit but other than that that's basically it if you guys have any questions on how you splice or making a beat in general drop it in the comments below please don't forget to like and subscribe and comment to this video thanks